everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. For those of you that are new to my channel, I want to say welcome. And for those of you that are a part of the Fab Whitney family, welcome back. My name is Crystal and you're watching Fashion, Beauty & Wine. So on today's episode of Wine Down Wednesdays, we are going to be talking about my favorite summer wine. I'm super excited to be doing this video and I'm even more excited to be showing you all what my favorite wine is because for a lot of you, this may be just a new wine that you're incorporating to your vocabulary. So if you wanna find out what that wine is, stick around and keep watching the rest of the video. Okay, so I have a little secret to tell you. I told a little fib and I actually have more than one wine that I go to when you're talking about some of my favorite summer wines. So the first one that I'm gonna be talking about, and I actually have four because I kinda wanted to hit every single category when you're talking about nice summer wines, is a Vino Verde. Now, Vino Verde is new to the American market. It's probably a wine that you've never heard of. It is a grape that originated and is mainly produced in Portugal. This one is by the company called Avalada. It's almost like a platinum green. This wine is going to give off green flavors. This wine in particular is giving me Granny Smith and citrus flavors. Now, initially you're gonna get residual sugars and effervescence, but the finish is gonna be more acidic, more ripe, but overall the flavors are still light, clean, crisp, and refreshing. Um, if you like a Savion Blanc, if you like Riesling, it's gonna be somewhere in between those. I wouldn't classify this as a dry wine. It's definitely not dry. It's a nice, light, refreshing summer wine to go to when you want to sit out on the balcony and just relax with your girlfriend and just sip and talk about the latest fashion and beauty gossip. So the next wine that we're gonna talk about is the Purity Orange Wine. So if you watch my last wine video, you would know that the orange wines are produced from white grapes. I've been really trying to explore different wines and really just venture off from the typical wines. And this wine I kind of stumbled upon because I was looking for something along the lines of natural and this wine is that. The owner of this winery, he kind of prides himself on making natural wines and he kind of let the grapes do the work and whatever comes from that, literally is what he's serving to you. So he tries to, you know, steer clear from all of the preservatives and all of the additives and produce something that's pretty much natural. Like if you look at the bottom of the jar, you're gonna see a lot of residuals. And this just comes from the wine being natural. Now, this has no added sulfites. Whatever sulfites are in there are the sulfites that come from the grapes. Lately, I've been getting really, really bad headaches from drinking just regular wines. And so I wanted an alternative that would not give me headaches and cause me so much pain after drinking the wine. So I stumbled up on natural wines and after drinking these wines, I will say that I don't have the hangover or the headaches that I usually get from regular wine. I really love this brand because you're gonna get pure forms of wine when you're drinking his wine. So a little fun fact about this wine. The owner still mandates that the grapes are crushed by foot, so yes. Every single bottle of wine that you're getting is going to be crushed by foot. Just a little fun fact. Obviously they clean their foot, but like, you know. So the next wine that I absolutely love, it's a new find, but nevertheless, it is delicious and I love it. And I'm so glad that I found this wine. The wine that I'm talking about is Von Bull. It's a bone dry rosé and it is produced in Germany. So this rosé is very light and acidic, but it tastes like sweet tarts without the sugar. So if you like a nice, crisp, refreshing, light rosé with bursting flavors of fruit, this is going to be your go-to wine. It is absolutely delicious. It's a great summer wine once again, and I just absolutely love the flavor profile. Like I've had troubles with finding great rosés, but I will have to say this rosé is just stunning. It's, it's everything that I go for when I'm looking for a wine, and it's easy to drink. Like it's not one of those wines which has too much acidity where you can only drink one glass and you're like, man, that's just too much to handle. No, it's well balanced. It's a nice balance of acidity and fruit forwardness, but there is no sugar. So yes, you're gonna get strawberries and raspberries and all like red ripe berry flavors. This is delicious. The last wine that I want to throw into the category is 
a wine for those of you that don't want to drink a dry wine but you want something sweet like you just want to enjoy something you want to drink it really fast and you don't want to have any cares you don't want to have any worries the wine that i'm talking about is the chateau saint michel now chateau saint michel has been around forever and you can find this literally everywhere i got this bottle from sam's club you can find it in costco your local grocery store whole foods or your local specialty wine shop it is a wine that is well known and a wine that you know if you get it it's gonna be great it always tastes the same no matter what year it is. For the most part, they try to keep the flavor profile the same. This wine is, they put it in the middle of medium dry, medium sweet, but I think it's extremely sweet. It's easy drinking and it's just a safe wine. So if you want something sweet that's affordable, that's great for the summer, I would highly suggest this Riesling. It's always a pleasure to drink this wine. Like I've never had a bad experience and let's knock on wood that I never have one. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have, don't forget to press that thumbs up button. And if you are watching this video and you're not subscribed, take a moment to press that subscribe button. And then while you're at it, press the alert bell so that you can be alerted every time I post a new video. Now I am on social media. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Musical.ly, and whatever else, all under keywords, fashion, beauty, and wine. So follow me on those channels. Again, I want to thank you for joining me. I wish you all nothing but peace, love, fashion, beauty, and wine. Bye-bye. <laughs>